Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. In this series, we are talking about our cell ticket add-on. And today we're going to talk in depth about cell ticket working with WooCommerce. So for that, we need to purchase some ticket first. So let's head over to events. And let's select this event from our list. So in here, we have three kind of tickets. Let's select this premium ticket. Let's raise this charity value to 150. Now we can click on order now. So here we have our standard WooCommerce card page. We have our product name, our product price, we have our quantity, our subtotal, and then we have our product removal button over here. Then we have our card totals. For this event, I didn't set one ticket per user for this premium ticket, but I did set one ticket per user for this charity ticket. So as you can see, we can modify the quantity over here for this ticket as this ticket wasn't set to sell one ticket per user but this charity ticket is so we cannot modify the quantity for this ticket we can update the card from here like we can increase and decrease the quantity for this ticket and down below we have our subtotal our fee and our grand total we have a dedicated video about this fee structure and how it works in our channel feel free to look it up for more details so that's out of the way we can proceed to checkout so in here on the checkout page, we have our standard billing details that WooCommerce requires in our left hand side. On our right hand side, if you notice, we have additional information where the order node, that's how WooCommerce default field. But below that we have ticket one, ticket two, ticket three. So we purchased two premium ticket. So that's ticket one and ticket two. And ticket three is our charity ticket. So for each ticket, an individual is required to fill in their name and email address so when we fill out these details and proceed with the checkout after that our registration add-on will make a registration using this name and email address so this is why we require registration add-on for our sale ticket add-on to work with and we also have an in-depth video how we can customize these fields over here such as this full name and email address and include some additional fields even remove this existing fields over here as well feel free to check that video out in our channel and if you find that video useful and informative don't forget to leave a like on that video so let me fill this information up really quick so i have filled all the information up and in here we have our order summary so premium ticket quantity 2 charity ticket quantity 1 we have our subtotals over here we have our fee and then grand total so let's click on place order and we will land right into our order confirmation page so here we have our order number our order date our order email and our total amount and the payment method below that we have our order details so our product details our premium ticket chart ticket quantity subtotal fee and payment method and the grand total below that we have our billing details as well so this is our full and final order confirmation page so this is how the checkout or the purchase flow looks like with our sell ticket add-on and WooCommerce. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and if you found this video informative, a sub to the channel would be awesome. Being that said, I'm Shada signing off. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.